Andy Murray has become known for his lengthy battles during matches and needed almost 90 minutes to win a set against Yannick Hampman. Andy Murray made fun of his lengthy matches after needing 2 hours and 20 minutes to beat Yannick Hampman in straight sets. The Brit came through a ridiculous opening match at the Swiss Indoors Basel on Monday. And he joked that an 83 minute set was nothing after his 7, 5, 6, 4 marathon. Murray has earned himself a reputation for playing lengthy matches this year, usually being dragged to a final set and getting embroiled in endless deuce games. He kept it up at the Swiss Indoors where the score was still only 2-1 after half an hour and 3-2 following 45 minutes of play when he faced Hampman in the first round. The world number 40 ensured that the first set wasn't an easy one after leading 5-2 as he was broken while serving for it and eventually closed it out 7-5 after 85 minutes. And Murray joked about his reputation after seeing another set go the distance with Zhu Lin needing 83 minutes to edge Veronica Kuttermedeva 7-6, 5, in a tiebreak at the Zhuhai Elite Trophy. Andy Murray is that you? Tennis journalist Jose Morgado tweeted alongside a screenshot of the lengthy first set. But the 36-year-old thought they didn't come close to his own antics. 83 minutes for a 7-6 set is nothing Jose come on. Come back to me when they hit 85 minutes for a set, he replied. It comes after Murray claimed it was ridiculous to spend 45 minutes playing the first five games of his match against Hampman. Speaking after he notched a win over the German, Murray said, it was tough. The first four or five games were something like 45 minutes. I don't remember having that really before, it was ridiculous. And then had a chance at the end of the first set, didn't get it and just managed to sneak a break at the end. The three-time Grand Slam champion will be hoping to keep things short and sweet when he faces Tomas Echeverri with a quarterfinal spot on the line. But in true Murray fashion, he could be dragged into another dogfight. Murray cemented his status as a marathon man at the very start of the year, winning two dramatic five-setters at the Australian Open. After leading 13th seed Matteo Berrettini by two sets, the Italian stormed back to force a decider that Murray won. In the second round, he came from two sets down to beat Thanasi Kikinakis in a 5-hour and 45-minute match that lasted until 4.05 a.m. A few weeks later in Doha, Murray played four deciding set matches to reach the final, saving three match points in his first round match and five more in the semifinal. He will be hoping to reach his first ATP Tour final since his dramatic Doha run at this week's Swiss Indoors.